Internet Life. You're watching Investment. Hello, I'm Shweta and you're watching Investment. A fresh perspective brought to you by MetLife. The market is booming with Sensex having crossed 21,000 points and the future looking good. In the wired and informed world today, the market savvy customer is out there to make his money work for him. The advisor finds it easy to sell Yule products and yes, the company is also grossing huge AFYPs. Then why this call for traditional products? The US market saw a similar boom in early 30s and we all know what happened. Today with me on the panel is Mr. Som Nivesh, who has been working for past 15 years as an independent investment advisor after quitting a flourishing banking career. So Mr. Nivesh, what is your take on the subject? Well, in the long term, the market has given us very good returns and in the past 20 years stand as a testimony to this. I just don't understand why these people get worried with these fluctuations. But don't you agree there are some things which are non-negotiable for the common man's concern for the future, like the children's education, daughter's marriage, and his own retirement, which cannot be market-linked? I mean, if a man has invested with you for 30 years for his retirement, and the market crashes when he turns 60, will you ask him to wait till the market booms again? Imagine the plight of the man. What do you expect him to do at that age? I feel for people of any age group today, their priorities have changed. They are not anymore looking for safe investments. Rather, they would like their investments to grow. And once it's done, the future is taken care of. So property, ULIPs, mutual funds, stocks, invest there. Life apne aap surakshit ho jayegi. We have Mr. Ravi Kumar, Associate Director, Product Development. Let's see what he has to say. Over to Ravi. Thanks, Shweta. The basics of insurance is similar to the basics of eating. So when we look at our diet that we eat, we have something called the staple food, which could be a rice or wheat. Then we move on to fruits, vegetables, milks, meats. And finally, we come to the fatty foods and the sugars. While we all know that the fatty foods and the sugars are tastier, more scrumptious, but at the base of it all has to be something like chapatis or rice. In that sense, I see a bhavishya, a suvidha, or a metsuraksha as the base of a healthy insurance diet. One must have cakes. It's not to say that one doesn't need to eat cakes, but one must have bread before that. At MetLife 2008 is the year of the customer. Here's to ensuring a healthy insurance diet for the customer. If you look from the distributor's point of view also, traditional products provide a steady stream of income because here the policyholder is obliged to pay the premiums for the entire contract period. Unlike in case of unit link products where the policyholders have the advantage of getting into a premium holiday mode and need not pay renewal premiums maybe after 3 or 4 years even though the entire policy term for payment of uh, premiums may be 10-15 years. So hence the distributors also will earn steady stream of income if they push traditional products along with unit link products so that the risk of uh, policyholders not paying per renewal premiums is mitigated to a large extent. We also caught up with the training team. Let's hear what they have to say. No one product can fulfill all the needs of the client. So if you analyze the need and sell as per the three cornerstones of financial security, then the traditional policies will definitely find a place in your solution. Remember the mission in the commission. Okay, that's not me, but financial experts across the world say that any solid financial planning has to be like a pyramid. It needs to have a strong and a solid base, which means the base needs to have two things which are very important. Number one, it should be permanent and number two, it should be guaranteed. And to my mind, the best example is a traditional life insurance program where the sum assured is guaranteed and it runs for a lifetime. So what do you have to say about this, Mr. Nivesh? Well, not quite. I still feel that you are uh, putting in too much for too little. At the end of the day, you are getting peanuts. I, I still don't understand this defensive attitude. Defensive? No, you can call it a responsible attitude, being technically correct. Well, well, the discussion is really becoming interesting here. At this point, we take a short break, and after that, we'll see what the top management from MetLife has to say. <laughs> If, for such a small word, it packs a wallop. We all have our personal ifs. Some are big, if I live to 100. Some are small, if I break my pinky and have to type left-handed. 
Today, if is in the news a lot. If my benefits from work can't do it alone. If Social Security isn't enough. If can hold you back. If I fall. If my heart gets broken. Or if can propel you forward. If it works. If she says yes. We believe if should never hold you back. If should be managed with the plan that builds on what you already have. Together, we can create a personal guaranteed safety net. No, a launching pad for all those brilliant ifs. A million types of ifs, and they're all smack dab in the middle of life. Call on our expertise, and we can make a plan with guarantees for the if in life. After all, we're MetLife. Welcome back. We have Mr. Som Nivesh in discussion with us on MetLife investment. Before the break, we were into a heated discussion on the benefits of traditional policies. Let's see what the top management from the MetLife has to say. The Indian economy is looking up and the stock market is doing very well. This has led to a lot of banks and other financial services companies to sell a lot of investment products. This has created a gap in your customer's portfolio. Gap for savings products, gap for protection products, gap for guaranteed products. And this is a gap that you can take as an opportunity to go and cover. I was doing my investment planning and I wanted to buy something for my children, for my daughters. This happened a couple of years back. I had the option of uh, investing in, in mutual fund market or ULIPS. I had the option of buying NSCs or a fixed deposit or traditional plans. And for my children, believe me, I never went for ULIPS because I wanted something which is very, very secure. Uh, and from that time till today, I have never called traditional products as traditional products. I call them as family products because they are family products. Today, uh, we are not switching from ULIPS to traditional. We are not doing it all. What we are saying is that every client needs to have fulfill his basic and first need of security for the family. And that is where traditional comes in between. Let us look at some of the benefits of traditional products from the company's perspective. The most important is profitability of the company. Traditional products help the company acquire US GAAP profitability faster compared to unit link products. Being more capital efficient, the long term nature of traditional products ensures a healthy cash flow over a longer period. Better predictability of inflows and outflows in traditional products ensures the long term financial health and stability of an organization. So if unit linked insurance products are diamond for the company, traditional products are gold. And to hold a diamond, you always need a base of gold. So, Mr. Navesh, does all this leave you with a change of heart that an insurance need is not always about ULIPS? Well, it is not about me winning or losing. The most important point here is, why aren't the financial advisors pushing for these traditional policies more? When you've got so many benefits like tax benefit, some assured low risk guaranteed returns, and most of all, peace of mind. I mean, I for one would like to go in for as many as possible or at least some of these traditional policies. Sure, we have got a small capsule wherein financial advisors speak about traditional policies and the success they are achieving with it. I sell traditional plans to my clients as I believe that they offer guaranteed protection to my clients and their families. For many of my clients, protection and saving for child education and marriage is the most important need. For those clients, I offer endowment plan as a first choice. So I believe that the traditional plan take care of all three financial security needs of the client, protection, accumulation, retirement. A win-win formula for advisor and customer. This is Ankita, my three-year-old daughter. I have a mid Bhavishya for her. Know why? Number one, affordable premiums. Number two, it has guaranteed returns. Number three, it comes at important milestones. Number four, whether I'm there or not, I have ensured her future. Can there be a better product than this? We got a beautiful product called Market Protector. Market Protector. So in that, it's a liability coverage plan. Where uh, I have sold almost all 76 numbers in two months where the contest was there during those contest time. So it was, it happened in 2003. The, the customers whom I have sold liability coverage uh, are kept me in the business till it. They are, they are my repeat customers. In fact, they are my referral customers. They give references. They call me and tell somebody is having a liability coverage. Somebody has got a new baby. Give them a good option for their future. Let's see how traditional plans benefits to the financial advisor. If you traditional plan, then the premium paying term is more than 10 years, 15 years and 20 years. So, 
I get regular income for coming 10 years, 15 years. So because of this regular income, I can plan for my family, my daughter. Thirdly, if something happens in my life, so I am sure that those commissions will get my legal heads and my family. Well, that's all we have on investment today. I thank all the speakers from MetLife who shared their valuable views, and especially to you, Mr. Som Nivesh, for being here on the show. Well, it has really been an eye-opener for me, and I, on my part, will surely advise my clients from now on to go in for a balanced portfolio. Hope all of you out there got benefited from the discussion we had today, and we look forward to your feedback on this episode. Have a great day.